While a rarity at most dive locations, frogfishes are actually quite common in the Lembe Strait, where conditions are ideal for them. Frogfishes are highly camouflaged to resemble sponges or rocks covered in algae. They have an amazing ability to adapt their skin colour and texture to blend in with their surroundings, and numerous colour variations of the same species can be found. This makes it very difficult to distinguish between different species. There is debate over the taxonomy within the family, and scientists are currently studying genetic samples in an effort to clarify the classification. The second frogfish in the rear of this shot is so well camouflaged that I fail to notice it until reviewing my footage after the dive. Frogfish's gill openings are hidden away behind their pectoral fins. Large quantities of water can be expelled from the gill openings to give the frogfish jet propulsion when swimming. Rather than blending into the surroundings, this warty frogfish mimics toxic sea slugs to deter predators. Although frogfishes can swim, they usually walk around on their pectoral fins, which have evolved into arm-like limbs, complete with an elbow-like joint. Although they will sometimes slowly stalk prey, frogfishes are generally ambush predators and have a very clever hunting technique. Their first dorsal spine, the elysium, ends in a fleshy lure known as an esker, which resembles a variety of marine creatures depending on the species. The frogfish waves the elysium like a fishing rod to attract prey. The appearance of the esker is useful in distinguishing between species. If the elysium and esker are removed, the frogfish can grow a replacement. The elysium is not always deployed, and opportunistic frogfishes will snatch what food they can. They will often just lie in wait, their upturned mouths ready to devour unsuspecting bypassers. The giant frogfish often takes up a more elevated position like this tube sponge from which to ambush prey. This warty frogfish appears nervous as it finds itself in the path of a highly venomous flower urchin. The urchin finally chose another route. The striated frogfish is a real star amongst Lembe critters and high on most divers' list of favourites. Many examples in the area bear long skin filaments and are known amongst the dive community as hairy frogfish. They are usually found on the open sand amongst algae. The esca resembles a polychaete worm. A black phase of the striated frogfish, without significant skin appendages, is sometimes seen. It's possible that the filament may be seasonally shed. Lembe is famous for the amazing ability of the resident dive guides to spot special subjects. One of them found this tiny but perfectly formed juvenile painted frogfish crawling across the sand. The pointer behind it is just a quarter of an inch in diameter. It opened its mouth as a warning to a tiny nearby crab. 
The sheltered conditions make the strait a successful nursery and juvenile fishes can be seen everywhere. This striking coloration belongs to a young spotted parrotfish.